name is Clint, and today is a very exciting day because I have with me a Ram China dress figure that we are going to unbox. I already have the Rem China dress figure. Rem is my favorite character from ReZero, and I just absolutely love the show. Um, don't kill me, but I've only watched the first season. Um, but I still consider myself a big fan. I've been waiting a few months for this one to come out, so I'm very excited to open this on this video today and, uh, and to share it with everyone. Oh, and just a reminder, I stream over at twitch.tv slash tightclint, uh, so if you'd like to see, hang out while I play any video games, uh, talk about anything, I'm a bisexual Twitch streamer, um, and I'm very open to talking about pretty much anything as long as it's not hurting other people on stream, and I stream Wednesday to Sunday at 7pm Mountain Time, so please drop in, and also like and subscribe this video if you like it, and leave a comment below let me know what other kinds of content you might want to see, or what you liked about the video. Okay, so we've got our little card that they sent with it. It looks a lot different than the one they usually send, and uh, I'm not sure if that's a little amigo there, but there, there's two characters on this one. Ami Ami always has a card like that that comes with the figures. Get this plastic off of here. These boxes that come with these these uh, China dress figures are very nice, but they are fucking huge. They are huge. All right. So this is the packaging. Let's uh, do a slow spin of this so that you can see it clearly. It's got the ReZero on the side and says Ram. On the back here, we've got some pictures of the figure. Another picture of the figure on this side with the name. see she's got some fans just like the rem figure has she has nylons and they're very realistic looking i know you can't see good now we'll get a close-up shot of the figure later let's open this up carefully i do use a box cutter but be very careful if you use one to not um, damage anything pull out the uh, blister. Okay, set it like this and we'll take off the top one. I'm sure there's some tape around here. Is that the last one? Did we get it all? <laughs> Let's see. Let's see if we got it all. Oh. Looks like a little stand piece popped out there. Okay, so we have the base right here, which fell down, so hopefully it's fine. It made me pretty nervous when it fell. I can't even get this out of the bag. Hold on. <laughs> so this is the base, and it's very, very cool looking. set this to the side and get the actual figure out and then we can set the blister to the side. The crystals on the base look very good though. They have her <laughs> wrapped in a lot of uh, a lot of protective stuff which is good. So this is the actual um, the actual ram. I keep wanting to say Rem, but I know that's not right. This is the actual Ram. She's a little washed out looking from the lighting now, but uh, very nice looking. And these are the fans right here. So I'm gonna pull these fans out. Let's 
bring the base over here. And we'll get her positioned in the base. So it goes like this. Gently slide her in there. Okay. So here is the beginnings of it. Let me hold that up a little. These crystals look so good. The figure looks very good as well. Something I'm very impressed with with this as compared to the Rem figure is that on the belt here, this belt is actually embossed. So she has this belt that goes all the way around her waist and it is actually completely embossed. And so are some of the edge designs. They're embossed very well. One of the complaints about these, these figures um, though was that these gold designs in the china dress between there, so like between the belt and between the edges, uh, those are not embossed. And I personally don't find a huge problem with this. You can see all of these designs here on the back part of this. In the um, prototype pictures, those were all embossed. So, so there, a lot of people were pretty upset about that and even sold the figures right away. But I still really like these figures and, and still wanted them a lot despite that. So if you, if you do want these though and you're looking to get some second hand or maybe they do a rerun of them, just be aware of that. Be aware that um, those patterns are not fully embossed, but the belt is embossed. Um, these pieces above her elbows on these sleeves are embossed. The edges are embossed um, on her on her head. There's a little hairpin and uh, her headband. Those are all embossed. So there are a lot of embossed features. Her shoes are embossed. Um, a lot of embossed kind of raised up surfaces are on the figure. Just be aware the designs are not completely. So let's get these fans. I'm still not sure what this is for. I, I don't know what this is. <laughs> There's one fan. There's the other fan. <laughs> okay, so we've got two fans. Now I'm not sure how these are supposed to go in. So there is a guide. And we're going to look at that to try to figure out how to put these fans in. Okay, so it looks like this is supposed to support her knee. Which is interesting because this is a similar pose to the Rem figure. But that one doesn't have anything supporting the knee. So we need to lift her out real quick. Okay, we now have that uh, <laughs> that knee support in place that, that props up her leg right there. So I don't know like how necessary that is, but there are a lot of figures that I've heard about them breaking um, because they don't have proper support. So I'm actually really glad to see that this has the support here. Like that's actually really, really good. So these fans, um, it looks like they just go in, they have a, a little angle on the corner there, and it looks like that angle just goes into a little slot she has on her palms. So, we're gonna try to get that in there. Okay, so yeah, it just kind of gently sits in there, and there is one other bit. This one does seem to fit a little tighter. I think it's because her hand is angled downward, so they don't want the fan to fall out. Oh, 
Okay, so that fan is positioned. That one actually, um, so putting that one in made me a little nervous because it took some pressure to get it in there and I could feel that her hand was kind of flexing a little with the pressure. So it made me nervous, but it's sitting in there now and we have both fans in. So this is the figure um, completely put together. That will just rotate this around right here so that you can see. It looks very nice though. I really like this figure. I actually am surprised because I didn't think I would like this as much as the Rem figure. But now that I see it, uh, these fans have a lot of detail on them. So there's indentation on each of the blades of the fans for where these little red lines you can see are and the little red dots on the tips, which I don't know if you can see in the video, but um, there's little red dots on the tips of the fans and they're very detailed. Her fingernails are also painted a light pink, and you can you can see that, and it looks very good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Again, I stream on twitch.tv slash tightplay. Sometimes I also just chat with my viewers there. I like to be a very conversational-based streamer. I stream Wednesday to Sunday at 7 p.m. Mountain Time. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe below, and let me know in the comments what you'd like to see in the future, or what you liked about the video. And until next time, stay chill.